can we make a trail dog out of an English Bull Terrier? Are you excited? Come on then. How's that? I'm definitely going to have to be careful. I'm so close to the ground. Okay, Colin, you ready to rip? Not far behind. Not far. Good boy. nice hi guys welcome to another vlog now this one's very different uh, for those of you who've been following pin for several years you'll remember that ian situated there my original trail dog still pretty fit but not really a trail dog anymore he's kind of retired he's about 11 years old now so he's uh resting his feet so we have colin Colin is now nearly a year and a half old. He's an English Bull Terrier, but he's one of the long-legged versions, so he's quite athletic. He's got absolutely bounds of energy. When uh, myself and Todd test the bikes out around the green here, he's right on us, running on the back wheel, and he loves it. He's dying to go out. So we're going to try him today. It's just me and him. Going to go to Eastridge. We've also got the dog mount as well. So... I'm going to take him for a few runs and see how much he can do before he gets tired. I'll make sure he doesn't get too tired because I love him. And uh, can we make a trail dog out of an English Bull Terrier? One thing's for sure, it's going to be interesting. Morning. Up. up on it a bit of countryside so just to let you know about colin's fitness he's not just a dog that goes walking and now all of a sudden i'm going to take him on a trail ride he's uh, a lot fitter than you think i i do trail running so i go once a week i do five miles off road and he comes with me and he does it so easily are you excited are you excited He has got his dog mount on for the camera. Come on then. There it is, got a mount there. Mount underneath. Had it years, but when I got that, the uh, camera stability was crap. So now, with this DJI, I reckon it'll be pretty good. Come on then, dude. Come on then. Yep, be ready to go. I've got uh, that on there which I can use facing backwards, hopefully get him. And I've got a brand new camera. Todd's taking us to Spain. And uh, I've got one on the camera, on the full face. Should get some good footage today. Not that way, son. All right, thank you. Hi, Jim. How you doing, all right? Yeah, yeah good, thanks. Come on, Cole. Let's go. Come on then, come on. How's that? Strap all right? He looked pretty happy. So just to let everyone know, I'm not gonna push him to any limits today. I know when he'll start getting tired and it's quite easy to get back to the van here. And when he gets starts getting tired, we'll be done. Is that good? Come on then, go on. Now they're not known for their intelligence, Bull Terriers. They're known for being hilarious dogs, got right characters. So I'm definitely gonna have to be careful with anything like that. So it is set in eco only, so I'm not tiring them out on the climbs. It's a pretty similar pace to if I was on the lightweight cross-country bike up the hills. Be excited, you can tell, because he's like zigzagging. So he needs to expend some of that energy, don't you, son? Let's get you on the first trail. And I think it's quite a tight trail, so I think he's gonna 
be quite close to me behind the bike so I think the first one can be with the camera on him right look at that view amazing you ready to rock Carl? you ready to rock? yeah? you ready to do some spinning? So we just checked the footage and it was, I'm really pleased with that, apart from the crap that got on the lens. So I think uh, now I know he can go easily at that pace, go on a slightly faster trail and see how he gets on. Nice steady ride up to the top again, eh dude? Trying to teach him not to go in front of the wheel so every time he does like that I go, wait, heel! See, he's learned that on the lead, so he can learn it on the bike. Teach your dog to heal, and it will help a lot. Good boy, aren't you? You're a good boy. So I've just devised a plan for this edit. The next one is gonna be bar mounted, another run. I'll show that, I'll show bits of that. Then there'll be a helmet mounted with me. Hopefully occasionally looking down or round at him if I can or where I can. And then finally, I'm going to put a little edit together of all three. Bit of music. Let's see how it comes out. Right. <laughs> I'm so close to the ground, I hope it doesn't get ripped off. Come here. Come on. Hey. It's going to be wobbly. Don't know if it's going to work, but we'll try it. Come on. Come here. Come on. Come on. Come on. I'm sure that's not going to work, it was too bouncy. Right, so the underslung one didn't work, it was no surprise really, it was too close to the ground. Uh, so it's now on the bars. The great thing about this camera is I can look at the front screen and look where it is. I'd say about there, maybe. Okay, Colin, you ready to rip? Tighten her up. Let's check out the stability. Come on then. Yeah, you me. Yeah, dude, where are you? Well done. Also worth knowing, Colin is fifth in the line of trail dogs that I've had over the years. So I'm no stranger to it. I know when the signs of them being tired and uh, you know, dogs will just keep going, but as long as you can Watch out for the signs, you're good. Ready to rip? Ready to rip, son? You just want to say hello to those sheep. Can't let you near them. Right, so trail now with me on the head cam. Probably won't see him much, 
but we'll use this for the edit at the end. Look at him. He loves it. He just loves being out, don't you, dude? He's raging to go. He does this little whinging. This whinging he does means he wants to run. So I'm not worried about him being tired just yet. Come on then. Ready? Good boy. Far behind, not far. Good boy. Look up there. One. You see him? Three deer. Don't want Colin to see him. He won't see me. I've got the best eyesight. You got no idea they're up there, have you, Col? I don't think you'd catch him if you did know. You want to carry on, do you, dude? Saying, come on, I'm not bothered about that. Now, if you're wondering about the dogs I've had over the years, I had Difa and Seth back in the 90s who were Staffy's cross. One was Staffy Labrador cross, the other one was a Staffy English bull cross. Then I had Huey, who was a Patterdale terrier, and then there's Ian, who we still got who is a Jack Russell pug and then there's Colin Colin, are these trails for you? That stumps for you. Oi! No! That fox poo That's a bull terrier thing They rub themselves along the grass and I want to put the camera underneath him so I need him to get that out of his system I'm gonna do a short bit of the camera underneath him because it's so close to the ground, it's gonna get crappy. What are you doing? What are you doing? Hey! Go here. Go. Go. Right, sit. Sit. I'm gonna put the camera on you now, so you need to chill a minute. All right, Colin Cam, so look at that. Ready to rock, son? Come on then. Come here. Oh, he got all twisted. Camera's got all twisted. <laughs> that alright? Come on then. Go right down. Well, it's a bit fast to start with and then it'll slow up so you can catch me on the slow up bit I'll wait for you okay happy come on then yes dude you alright? Don't seem too out of breath. Seem pretty happy. Keep keeping an eye on them through the ride, make sure they're okay. He's buying right now, aren't you? You can tell the difference on like bits like that where it's a lot faster. So you get on a fast bit, you always need to be waiting for them at the end of it and just check they're alright. So this bit's a lot steeper but a lot slower. So it should be on me down here. Come here. Come here, Cole. Can't lead. Good 
boy. We take it off you now. That's the other thing, make sure they can have a drink. You know, if you're out on a dry hot day, make sure that you know there's a water source. And bring some snacks. Just reminding me, I've got a cliff bar here. One each. Come here, dude. Come here. Come here. Sit. You want it? Yeah. Nice. Another dog alert. Could get interesting. Come on. Oh, yeah, yeah. Are you alright? He's friendly. Yeah. Come on. <laughs> Good boy, Colin. Just wanted to say hello. Another thing, if you can do it, if your dogs like swimming, Stop them making muscles, let them go in some nice cold water. Good luck getting Colin in. Go on then. I'll try. Not that keen on the water. What's this? What is it? Go get it. Go on then. Go on. Go get it. Go get it. Go on. Go on. Made him have a drink, that'll do. These are the bits where you'll knacker a dog out more than anything on a trail ride, the downhill fire roady bits. So just get on the brakes, not in any rush, and just let them go at a trot. As long as they're jogging or trotting, not sprinting everywhere, should be okay. Heading up for uh, the run back to the van. A uh, little bit of uphill to the bar cam. Ready? Come on then. Good boy, come here. So as the sun is out, finally. On the first day of spring, Colin's just started to pant, but he's absolutely fine. We're going to do the trail back down to car. And there's the camera, no on the helmet, on the very aptly named trail called Old Dog New Tricks. Can this old dog teach this new dog some new tricks? Right, run of old dog. Whoa, very slippy today. Is he there? Yeah, he's behind. Come on then. Whoa, shit. A bit of a slip on then. Ooh. Where is he? Dropping him a bit, but he's still. Are you panting? Hey! Not too bad, come here. He's still happy. Yeah, definitely haven't overdone him on. I think, I'd say, I've got me a new trail dog. Not a thing, I'm sure. So, you might see Colin on some more of the riding videos with us from now on, which is ace. So tell us what you think about this. Anyone who's sort of, I've had him say it before, when I started thinking about it, saying, oh no, you can't take a bull breed, not a trail dog, blah, blah, blah. I'll disagree. It's not about the breed, it's about the actual dog itself. And this dog is all right for it. I'd know if he's tired. Energy, don't you, son? Let's get you. That's about there, maybe. Right. <laughs> I'm so 
So, thank you for watching. See you soon. Keep it pinned. Happy Colin. You go home and have lots of sleep and lots of food. Here you go, boy. So, for anyone who thinks uh, I knackered him out, this is three hours later with his mate Bruno, the puppy. I think he's okay. <laughs>